We said that uh, if we continue to play like we do, like we are through that first half, we're not going to beat this team. This team is too good. Uh, we needed to really tighten our game up, especially you know defensively, and even get more ball movement. We were doing a lot of stuff uh, individually. I mean, we had six three-point shots in the first quarter, six three-point made in the first quarter, and yet we were still down by five at the end of the first quarter. I mean, uh, uh, and that's really not our game. We went; the ball wasn't moving. Uh, we talk about the ball whizzing, whizzing around, and it wasn't whizzing around. It was. Ball was very slow going around the, uh, the, the court. But uh, they came out third quarter and really started to do the things that, uh, that they're really good at in terms of ball movement defensively. Uh, we were helping in, in the right places. And uh, that was key in our offense in terms of transition. So um, really good third quarter and, and early fourth quarter. Uh, and we're surprised. I mean, I'm, I'm absolutely surprised. Uh, that's that's. Uh, we were really looking at the standings going into this game. We knew it was a big game for us to win, uh, to knock them to four losses, and also to get the quotient. So, um, big performance for, for us. Uh, we, we've been a, a team of two halves uh, every, all all conference long. We played one average or below average half, and then we play one great half. And today we play the, the average half in the first first half, and then we play a great second half. But we've got to kind of find a way to kind of smooth that out. I don't think, uh, I don't know what you guys thought, but I didn't think uh, Romeo Travis was moving very well out there. I mean, he was moving okay. He wasn't limping noticeably, but he just wasn't as explosive as he normally is. And he was doing a lot from, uh, playing a lot from the perimeter out there. And uh, that usually means that uh, his ankle was bothering him. So uh, that was, that was, and I, but I also thought we did a really good job uh, on Paul Lee tonight, uh, keeping the ball out of his hands. And when he did it, get it, we were, we were uh, getting, throwing two guys at him. And uh, he's been on, Paul Lee has just been on fire the last couple of games. Uh, we were watching the video and he is just making incredible shots. So we, we really challenged our guys to go out there and try to put the clamps on him. And even then, he still hit big shots. Uh, he's an incredible player. Thank you. You can always interview. Thank you.